<laughs> good morning. We never said good night last night because oh. um, I yeah. passed out. We, we drove back from Volcano in the dark and that was a lot. My neck is stiff from how stressed out I was. But Will did great. Did you bring your glasses? Yes, I did. Oh, thank God. We have nighttime glasses now. Um, And now we're heading first to a little gift shop because I love gift shops. So we're gonna do that. Um, but we're in the um, town of Kona. Is that this one? Um, and we're gonna be driving a lot today. So expect a lot of car vlogs. But look how cute the little downtown is. I think it's so super duper cute. So we're gonna go check out a gift shop that's been here for 30 years, Will said. That's what I said. Yay! Where are we, Will? Where are we, Will? Whoa. The National Park. This one. There's a drawing. Oh, Jesus. There's a drawing of a person. We're on a hike in the national park. We found. There's some more drawings. Drawings. It's pretty cool. That's your park. It's pretty cool. Okay, let's keep grooving. This is where we are. <laughs> This is the subtitles to the video. Wow. <laughs> we walked a freaking mile to be here today. Look how pretty it is. Look, there could be turtles out here too. Do, 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 do. I believe this is a canoe house. They call this dog canoes. We made it. Oh, this is a beautiful view. Look for here. There's some crabs. I don't know Sebastian. if they are okay. Yeah, it looks like his insides have been taken out. Yeah. He's got no legs. So. Oh god. Okay. That was kind of depressing. I believe these are like the fish, fong, fish ponds which the ancient people built so they could trap fish when the tides receded and they could hunt them more easily. Very clever. Ahead of their time. Here's an aerial shot of what we're looking straight out at here. You might want to see that they have these little pens which they built here out of this volcanic rock. And it's hard to see from the side profile but from the aerial shot here, this is the cabin where we're at. The canoe lodge thing and then we have the... Uh, rock pens here to store the fish and then out to the left we see the pile of rocks over there by that palm tree that is the site of an ancient temple that the first people here built too on that site and they built it because the fish traps and the temples and stuff all kind of came in you know, it was all sort of uh one and the same right pray to the gods of fishing and stuff and there you have it folks As Will said, a C-17. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, really. We're just walking some more on rocks. Sacred temple. Sacred temple. We made it over here. Wow, the water is really clear. Let's take a peeky. But it doesn't seem real deep because they're just standing out there. It's cool. There's the temple. This is what our walk has looked like. Lots of rock. 
They had larger, flatter rocks back there, which used to act as a trail for carriages and horse-drawn carts and things like that. Um, way back when too, when the people were transferring stuff between little villages. Cute. This is what the walk looks like. Just an FYI, bring nice shoes. Well, yeah. good hiking shoes. There's the big mountain though. It's pretty cool. Can we try to look at that red? And you can hear the ocean from here as well. Yay! More walking. Hello, everybody. That was a very nice walk. Um, it was very hot. So if you do that walk, it's about a mile. A mile there and a mile back on rock for the most part. Um, Will's in the bathroom, um, but we are gonna head out to a coffee thing. I don't know, coffee farm maybe? Um, so that's exciting. And, which is up in the mountains, Will said, so that's pretty cool. Hi Will, where are Hi. we? Hi, welcome to like 3,000 feet in the air. We're at Mountain Thunder. Coffee, can I have coffee? I keep calling it Thunder Mountain. <laughs> I got this huge coffee sack, which I didn't even think they would have. It was only $20, and I'm gonna frame it and then put it on my wall. I saw someone do that once, and it looks cool, and so I'm gonna do that one because it has a cool volcano. Thanks, Will. Will got some coffee for his brother and a postcard. Um, we did the tour and it was really cool. She's actually from Winter Garden, so that was kind of funny. Um, but, fun fact that I learned, espresso is the least amount of caffeine and light roast is the highest. And I always get light roast because I thought it was the least. <laughs> so, get dark roast if you want a lighter caffeinated and a light roast if you want the most caffeinated and getting a shot of espresso doesn't do anything so that's crazy it's got taste yeah stronger taste. taste crazy the more you know there's the beautiful views oh no there's a big tour bus i've got so many cars the big island. Look at all the lava going to the sea. Join us at Rainbow Falls. 
It's a waterfall. It's called Rainbow Falls because when the sun hits the water just right in the mornings, it's just all rainbow apparently. a short little hike, we can end up here. And then it goes all the way down. It's beautiful. Really out of breath. One last shot. Absolutely beautiful. So the big cave thing behind the waterfall back there yeah. is supposedly, according to mythology, where uh, the mother of Maui, the goddess of something or other, uh, <laughs> lived back behind there. Oh, so, yeah. amazing. And then she fought a gigantic lizard. And now he came out and defeated the lizard, and then he will attack over after us. And on sunny days, you can see rainbows, but on rainy days, like today, they say it looks like a wreath. That's what I read. It's kind of cool. We all got the salmon pokey. Okay. I got the everyday Joe one. You may recall that we drove down this road earlier today between the two volcanoes. We've made it to this third one here. Kill the whale. Yeah, I think it's, it's definitely, you know, but I think it's a <laughs> We're looking into the small crater. We're yet to even see the big one. I think I can see some smoke coming out of the big one or something. This one is the one that erupted some steam vents. a while ago, but it did like 17 erosions. I was reading about it. It was 2018. This one? I thought that was the other one. Oh, it's all the same, isn't it? Oh, God. It's all the same volcano. Okay. Anyways. Adventures out there, folks. That's crazy. <laughs> Oh, it's rock. Well, we walked through the lava tube. I thought it was actual lava, but this is just what the lava formed, everybody. So don't get misled. There's a tour group up there. That's pretty cool. This is the, what we were just in. We made it to the crater. The crater, everyone. We're on it. And we're about to walk on it a little bit more. Well, Will figures out where we have to go. But how freaking cool is this, everybody? This is so incredible. Wow. It's so peaceful. We made it. The whole place to ourselves. I got a 
sneeze. This is pretty scary, everybody. Nobody else <laughs> seems to be coming this way. <laughs> but we are. We're doing it. We're actually farther than if we just turned back. We keep seeing these rays pop around. We just jumped over one. <laughs> moving above us. weren't gonna do it because it's kind of a long hike but there is a path by the way we're not just wandering it's just told by these rocks look at that Ooh. we walked across a whole thing and now we have to go up the stairs. But we did it. Yo, we freaking climbed all that. And that's the other volcano which we're gonna go visit, which looks like it's erupting. But I still can't believe we just hiked all that. I wasn't even recording it on my watch. I should have been, it's like four miles or something. Craziness. Oh, look at them all over there. All the, let me zoom in. Look at all those. What do you see? See all the... Oh my word, look at the whole thing's on fire. It's very cool. And now it's raining, so I'm going to put my camera away. But it's very beautiful. So that's the walk we did. Starts down here. Went all the way to the other side. We did that. That's a frog that you're hearing. Some of the nodes 
down there. Mm -hmm. Which are collecting important seismic earthquake related sedimentation for scientists. Which is like insanely big. Like earlier today, they were shrouded by clouds and stuff. Now we can finally see it. The very tippy top. And just at the crater we'll be looking at today, they've got a crater too. We're only at 4,000 feet. That one over there is at almost 14,000 feet. Fun fact, if you were to take the slopes of the volcano and pull them all the way down <laughs> to the sea bed, it's going to be the tallest mountain in the world. It's like two Mount Everest tall. 52,000 feet. Yeah, it feels like out of the water, so that, that thing is a real deal. It's stuff. You need a four-wheeler basically to get up there. Oh, though. looks like this is all closed. Oh. Oh. Maybe you saw that? Yeah. Oh wow, saw It's freezing up here. Everybody. We are at, it's called the Volcano House, and it's like a little resort that is actually like literally off the mountain, or the volcano, sorry. Looks into the crater. Yeah, it looks into the crater. The big one or the small one? The big one. The big one. Um, and we called and asked if we could eat dinner here because we have a long journey back to the hotel, and they said yes. So we're gonna eat here and it's the cutest. It gives me like wilderness vibes. Um, and so I'm determined to come back when there's an erupting volcano. And we're gonna stay here because now I'm obsessed with volcanoes. But yeah, we're gonna go eat. For many native Hawaiians, craters, Santa Pele, the red earth goddess. Oh, this is about the goddess. For many people, there's a significant amount of mana or power. So what do you feel? But this is the restaurant, what your view is. You look down into the crater. Isn't that incredible? I'll zoom in a little bit so you can see. That is so cool. And you just see sulfur coming from everywhere. It's beautiful. Good evening. Volcano burgers. I don't know where it's gonna go when I'm filming. Hi everybody. Day has come. Will's not sad. I'm depressed. It's not. We're gonna make someone's video, look. Oh yeah. We're in someone else's vlog, but so. There's a big Royal Caribbean docked, um, and I didn't know that little tiny boats come and get them, mm -hmm. which is kind of cool. Little tenders. 
but we're going to get gas and then we fly to San Diego today and we spend the night and then we fly home the next morning. So depression has kicked in. Um, Look on the left, you want to see the ship? Oh uh, yeah, there's the ship. I don't know, I can't see because I don't have the screen. Look, 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 the lifeboats bring them across. Oh my gosh. Look, see? That's so crazy. Look, there they go. Oh yeah, they're come bringing them in. They come in on the lifeboats, it's really funny. That's so cool. <laughs> You're gonna try out the lifeboat. Wow. Um, and there they all are, just piled up over there. That's so funny. I've got my glasses on, I can't read what the ship is. It says, all I see is red. But anyways, that's our plan. Um, probably won't be videoing too much today, but we'll see. Um, might go in with the last vlog. But yeah, happy last day, everybody. Here we go to the Kona International Import. Airport, what did I say, import? I thought you said airport. Oh, did I? There's, There's a lot of lava. It is a very pretty drive. There's helicopters going everywhere. Our plane just landed. Our plane just landed. It's such a small airport we can see from the main road. Our own plane taxi. It looks there. very Hawaiian today. Thank you. There's the helicopter. The fog inside, look at the town. Mm. This is how cute and relaxed the airport is. And they have these luau girls. Let's go see. Look how pretty. It's just all outside and very relaxed. It's very cool. Will loves it. We're in an open air terminal, everybody. Welcome to the wildest hotel room ever. Um, with Will's credit card, we get, we got a free upgrade, I guess. And this is floor one, it's like a condo. And then that's the view with the balcony. And then you go up these stairs. Oh my gosh, and there's another door. Come join me on the landing. If you look outside this one? Yeah, what is that? It's like, a, it's a second entrance to this. Oh. But it's absorbed. Oh, wow. Okay, the roof. And then another bathroom. And then the be holy guacamole. The bedroom. We're in a townhouse. And it says, good evening, Wildem. Will <laughs> Wildem. Wildem. William. 
where does it where did it say your it said like gold elite or something and then here's the upper balcony hey this is crazy that's wild the ceilings are so tall thanks american express, thanks, american express.